Hey, what's going on? I'll play a little bit of this song and I'll teach it to you right afterwards. And you love, oh, you love. Um, so this is an easy version of what's going on. Uh, doesn't cover every single thing that John Mayer is doing because what tutorial could? Come on. Uh, but this is just kind of easily getting through the song. Okay, put on the second fret here. And here's the chords. Uh, D, second fret on that third string. These guys are on the third fret, first and second string. It's a D sus4, works as our D. Uh, C, fourth string, fifth string. It's a C add nine, works as our C. G, 5th string, 6th string. Um, e minor, these guys are on the 2nd fret, 5th string, and 4th string. It's like an E minor 7, works as our E minor. A minor, uh, just one up from the D, this guy is now on the 4th string. It's kind of like an A minor 7, works as our A minor. Um, strumming pattern I'm working with, it's kind of like down, Like that. Uh, that's mainly what I'm kind of working with through throughout. Uh, good. So next, let's go through a bit of the song. Call it chords as we go and slow it down just a bit to make it easier to play along with. Uh, good. Start from the intro. D, G, C, D, G, D minor. You D love who G love. to Katy Perry's verse. Um, Katy Perry's verse is simplified out. It just moves from like the D, G, A minor, over and over again. D, G, A minor. Good. Uh, over and over again for, for her verse. Then it comes back into the chorus. Uh, the bridge where it's... Uh, them kind of singing like oohs and stuff like that. It just follows the same as Katy Perry's verse, that D, G, E minor. D, G, A minor. Over and over again for that. Then it comes back into the chorus, and then after the chorus it has an instrumental, but it follows just the exact same chords as what the chorus was working with. So after that, the song's over. So. Hope it helps, and thanks for watching. See ya.